The Dorm That Dripped Blood is a slasher movie from the 80s. Now, I didn't know much about this movie, to be honest, but um, lately I've been into school-related uh, slashers. That's why, I've, and there's a lot of them, too, that, you know, involving either high school students or college or parties, a lot of college uh, party slasher movies out there. So The Dorm That Dripped Blood is about four volunteers. They are students who are tasked with cleaning out an old building on the campus so they go there to sort of uh, clean it out they have they have two weeks or like two weeks to like clean out everything however they suspect someone who's not supposed to be there is hanging around he's stalking one of the girls and then uh, people start dying so they assume it's him and now the students are trying to survive a, a night of you know volunteering with a killer on the loose so the movie starts off pretty good you got a couple kills here and there but overall, I felt that the movie kind of dropped the ball near the end. They revealed the thing way too early and um, a lot of cheesy moments. Some of the kills are really ridiculous. Like this one, uh, the, the killer grabs a, a woman and shoves her into like a giant soup pot. Um, there's the infamous drill scene uh, that that's pretty gory too. So there's a couple of interesting set pieces here and there. But I just felt the movie was really lousy especially the finale and it doesn't really give you a good ending either um yeah this one didn't leave much of an impression on me so i'll give the dorm that dripped blood a three out of ten girls night out is another slasher movie uh involving i believe high school students i've watched so many that they're starting to blend into each other which is kind of bad because i need to write more notes i guess but this one is about uh, teenagers being attacked by um someone in a mascot uniform and they've taped uh, or attached knives to the hands. So this uh, killer is the influence for Kugi in the television show Ash vs. Evil Dead Season 3. Uh, the opening sequence has um, Ash and his friends going up against the mascot mutated by a deadite and with like razor claws. So the inspiration for that came from this movie. The killer kills the guy who wears the mascot uniform, steals the mascot uniform, and then attacks different people with the claws on the mascot uniform. So that's like the only thing this movie has going for it because uh, the rest of the movie is really awful. There's barely any kills. There's a lot of like off-screen stuff going on, low-budget crap. Uh, I don't even remember the plot or the reason why the killer was after everyone. It really was just sort of a, a blur. Yeah, this one was just not memorable at all except for the mascot killer thing. So I give Girls Night Out a 2 out of 10.